name is Dr. Robert McCarthy, and I want to welcome you to my website on migraine headache relief. I'm a contributing author to this book, Energize Your Brain, Change Your Life. And you are here at this website because you or someone you know and love is suffering with migraine headaches. And I want to tell you, I know exactly what you're going through. How do I know this? Two reasons. First, I experienced migraine headaches in the past. Crushing killer headaches like someone sticking a knife through your eye. The pain was unbelievable. I couldn't open my eyes and I would need to go lie down in a dark room in complete silence. I'm here to tell you too that there is an answer for your migraine pain. I know because I found it and luckily uh, I've learned from some of the most brilliant minds in brain-based therapy how to deliver this care to you or your loved one. The, the second way I know that this works is we've been doing it for years. There's a number of different treatments available that are non-drug, non-surgical. And I know you're watching the video saying, well, I've been to this doctor and that doctor, I've been to the neurologist and I've been to the MRI center. What makes this guy think he's got the answer? I want you to, to listen to me here. First, I've gotten the care myself and I've gotten the results. Second, I've been delivering this care for years now and I've got hundreds of satisfied migraine relief sufferers who, who were dealing with medications and running around from doctor to doctor and now they no longer take medications and they don't need to go to the doctor anymore because their problems are resolved. See, if the medications worked, you wouldn't be watching this video. Medications cannot cure your migraines. All the medications on the market right now are there in order to control, minimize, or try and make your life a little bit more bearable, kind of take the edge off your migraine pain. And to me, that's just a backward system. That's not looking for the cause of your migraine. It's just treating your symptoms. It's covering up your symptoms. And that could be dangerous. If there's an underlying physiological problem in your body, the migraine headaches that you get are just a symptom of this underlying problem. To take a drug to just short circuit those symptoms is a dangerous thing because you're leaving the underlying problem in your body to just go on and on. What makes us different is that we look for the underlying problem. We leave no stone unturned in trying to figure out what it is that's causing your migraine headaches. And the causes can be varied, but we check many different solutions, basically neurological and metabolic solutions. And we do things that nobody you have ever seen has done as far as tests to determine where your problem lies and treatments in order to get your brain and your body functioning properly again. Some of the things that we do that, that nobody else does is we treat people neurologically and metabolically. Neurologically, we use brain-based therapy. And this is cutting edge stuff, folks. There's no drugs. There's no surgery, there's no pain involved in this therapy. We're basically finding the areas in your brain that are not functioning as well as they're supposed to, and we apply very specific treatments to get them functioning better. Metabolically, like I said, we do testing that nobody else has done. And I know you say, well, I've been to my doctor, I've had the blood work done, and all the tests came back normal. I've heard it. I've heard it thousands of times. But then when I request the records and I see the blood tests that were done, it, it, it's appalling. We tested maybe three different things. And then, and then they say they, the, the tests have come back normal. There's nothing wrong. Well, there's a difference now between what's called a lab normal and a functional normal. If we take TSH, for example, a thyroid stimulating hormone, the lab normals run from 0.5 to 5.0. And if you come in between those ranges, those, those values, your traditional healthcare provider will tell you that's normal. I'm here to tell you that's wrong. 
The functional normals put out by the American Endocrinology Society say that you should be optimally in between 1.8 and 3.0, a much narrower range. That's what we look for. We don't want to see if you are within the, the 95th percentile of this country. We know that there's a problem. You're experiencing pain. You've got crushing migraines. We want to get you functioning optimally. And when we look at all of these lab tests that we run, we want to see the narrow optimal range. That's what we expect for you. As far as um, what it would take to, to become a patient, to qualify for care here in our office, it's real simple. You need to fill out this form right over here on the right side of the page, and this will give us your information, and I will rush you off a DVD that explains first what makes us different and then secondly what it is we do in our office that can help you. Along with the DVD we're going to send you some more information, some more paperwork about how our office works and requirements and how you may be able to become a patient here in our office. You need to qualify for care. Now I'm going to be honest with you. We don't just blindly accept everybody who walks into the office. This is for people who are truly serious about getting help. Truly serious about, you know, chucking the drugs that they're taking. And I, I'm not going to take you off your drugs. We are going to fix your problems so that you can go back to the doctor who prescribed you the drugs and you can tell them, I don't want to use these anymore. I don't need these anymore. But I, I'll be honest with you, if you're emotionally attached to your problems, and you, you like the label that you have, migraine sufferer, and you like to use the drugs, this is not the place for you. It really isn't. So like I said, not everyone will qualify for care. You need to ask yourself these four questions. First, how has this chronic migraine situation affected your job, your relationships, your finances, your family? How is this affecting you? How is it affecting others? Two, what does it cost you in, 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 in terms of time and money and happiness and freedom? Third, where do you picture yourself to be in the next one, three, five years if you don't do anything about this problem? It's not going away on its own. It's not going away with what you're currently doing. And then fourth, what is it worth to you if we could improve your migraines. You need to ask yourself these questions and like I said you need to ask them seriously. We don't, uh, we are very busy here in the office and I don't have time to see people who aren't truly serious about their health care. If we run a test and we find out that you've got a certain sensitivity and I say you can no longer eat this food forever for the rest of your life and you are not going to follow my recommendations again don't waste either one of our time. If you are truly serious and you want to regain your health and regain your life, fill out this form. I'll rush you off my DVD and in the meanwhile I want you to check the end of my website. On the DVD we should have some and as well with um, www.lifechangingcare.com there are countless scores of testimonials from migraine sufferers whose lives have been changed. Hopefully, yours will be next. Thank you.